so dumb. I was like, like it was flat, but almost you have to like all up the bump. I tried 50 on the rail and I broke my finger and I hit my back on the rail. Just like a little rail. I was like, whoa. Check, this is my finger. My finger went like that. How that happened? Like how? And that's my face. <laughs> and the same day, I like hurt my finger. I come back home and I was playing game. And I was like, oh, it's good to play games, so it's all right, not that bad. <laughs> <laughs> I normally start my day like uh, playing game a little bit before going to skate. I play the fast one. When I'm not skating, like. I kind of play game a lot, you know. I don't want to like lose the game. I mean, I don't want to lose anything, you know. I just I'm a competitive a little bit. I mean, not a little bit, kind of a lot. <laughs> but when I'm skating solo with my friends or whatever, it's like I just focus on having fun, le learn tricks, and do my best every day, you know. I just know that I can be better all the time. And do like this. Ah no! Like, oh, that was a good one. So this is my room. Uh, my girlfriend is not here yet, she's traveling. My girlfriend is already Nishimura and she's professional skateboarder too. We like always skate the same contest. We like start talking like more and skating together. So like when I got back to California, I was like, okay, let's skate. And she like, yeah, let's skate for sure. She got like some trophy right there. You know, it's nice because me and her, we have like same this one. Oh, like, right. We got third place in Brazil, like same contest to watch like skate videos too, you know, like we, we sit down like on sofa people some skate videos and watch. It's nice, I like it. <laughs> it's crazy because I'm from Brazil and she like from Japan. She like couldn't speak English and I was learning. I mean, I'm still, I'm still learning, but it was like easier because like we skate, you know? So like sometimes we not talk, but we skating, you know? <laughs> I'm always like, wow, I want to skate for Red Bull someday. That's one of my dreams, you know? So when I, when I get on on Red Bull, I was like, wow, I was so happy. I couldn't sleep. I went to the bed and I put my hat close to me, just like right here. And I was like, wow, I'm skating for Red Bull. I'm skating for Red Bull for like two months. The best two months of my life. Feels good. I started skating when I was 11 and I skated my first contest. I was skating for like almost one month. <laughs> I supposed to go there just to watch. But when I got there on the contest, I started skating and my shoes were so tight. And in the middle of the contest, I take my shoes off and I start skating with no shoes. That's how I was skating before. I was like, yeah, it's the same thing. I remember I tried Ollie on the three blocks. I couldn't land anything. And my fingers was bleeding. My grip tape was like, you know, that was funny. Temporary. I was finished set up my board. We're going to get some food and go to the gym at the Red Bull. I always think about going there because I saw everyone like Zion, Leticia, Felipe. So I was like, oh, I want to go there someday and train, you know. Like sometimes when I like set up new board, I'm like, Odi, can I do it? Trip flip? And she said, no. But she's not here, so I'm going to try one. Before going to K, trip flip. And I did first try, so like, it's gonna be a good day, you know? Later. Sorry. What up? Yes, to have place like that too, working out is like, it's amazing, you know? You have everything, like have people there for you to help you and like whatever you want. And they show you the good way to, to do what you have to do. Yeah, Alex was helping me. I was talking to him like, what can I do to jump higher? So he was just showing me some stuff to do it, to be better on that. And, uh, and also I told him front threes is my favorite trick. So he was helping me doing like some workout with that. This one helps with the front three six. <laughs> Ready to skate. <laughs> I 
I love Cherry Park because like one of my first time in America, I was staying in the apartment like close here, so I was coming here like every day. My first time was here, I didn't speak any English. It was so funny because like people was came to me and say, oh my God, that trick was so good. And I would say like, thank you or sorry. That's the only thing I was saying. So like sometimes people was saying like, oh, that was so good. And I was like, sorry. But like, what do you mean sorry? And people was looking at me like, what? Everyone was like super cool. Everyone was like, like no, you good, bro. Like just like keep skating and let's skate soon. I was like, okay. I feel like home, you know? Same place I have like in Brazil, where I live, I, I have like Yapei, it's like Yapei Escape Plaza. I feel like home, I feel like my house, same thing. When I'm like in America, Cherry Park, I feel like home, you know? It's like, it's one place where I have like a lot of friends, like good spots to skate. And I mean, California is amazing, you know, like good weather. So let's go, let's skate. Ankle socks and shorts. I don't know who dressed this man. I don't know who taught him that was okay. What? You guys talking about me, huh? <laughs> you guys talking about me, huh? Huh? No, stay, stay slain, bro. Where's the hill flip? Dude, I'm trying. Ooh! <laughs> that was a good one. I got your back. That was a good one. That was for World Cup, you know? Too lazy. I say like, if I'm not land right now, I'm bad skitter. I'm such a bad skater right now, right, Lucas? Don't trip cause it won't stop. Let's go keep up and just walk with me. Just walk with me. Come and walk with me. Just walk with me. Go I bring fire. Let's buy buckle up, hold on, cause it's gonna get bumpy when you walk with me. Just walk with me. Come and walk with me. Just walk with me. Yeah, it's that Fiji and Modi again. I ain't rolling no bands, wasn't born to pretend. Got the passion of a broke man up on the mic. It's like I come out of my shadow, show you just what I'm like. You should be thankful, grateful with all that shit. I'm moving forward. Mother told me not to fall back with got dirty language, yet I still know how to talk. I pretty much say what I want, so you can hold all your thoughts. I'm on track, I know exactly what I'm out for. Maintaining the mind state that I've got for. Stay aiming for the top, near the clouds or even way further, like out of this fucking world. Was fitted with some fuzzy ambitions. I dream big, met some cool cats, pretty much told me to think. Let's eat, because I'm hungry. <laughs> it was a long day. So you okay. never played darts? No. Never at all. You have no idea. No, I mean, I saw like some videos on Facebook, but I don't know how that worked. Throw the dart at the board. I just know. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, give me so, the lesson again. So, it's just like this, and you throw it there. <laughs> but <laughs> so you gotta hit 20 first. 20. Yeah. And then once you get to 15, then you go for a bullseye. Whoever gets there first wins. I can't understand <laughs> anything. <laughs> And I play that, and I will beat you in the first time. <laughs> yeah, all right. Let's go. This guy. <laughs> oh. 20, 20, right? Yeah. <laughs> what did I tell you? <laughs> this first D. <laughs> okay, it's 19, right? No, 17, sorry. 17. No? No. I know. Calm down. <laughs> Just to make some pressure for you, like, you know? Don't be scared. <sighs> oh, my God. You're getting it. Okay. What? 16, 15, bullseye. Nope. Show me again. How about the 14? 16, 15. Oh, well, okay, dude. Come that's on, that's dude. a. All right, At you want me to yeah, you want me to bullseye it in the red? All right. Of course. Next yes. If you want to do something, do it good. Okay. Yeah. All right. You know? <laughs> that's fair, right? <laughs> I guess so. Yeah. It's hard, dude. Maybe switch easier. <laughs> All right. I didn't even turn the grill on. So today was a good day. 
and now it's time for barbecue. Thank you guys so much, and I see you guys later. <laughs>